So you guys are going to float around with me today. I'm working on this fuel cell. This, I just got done welding. This is going to sit on the toolbox tray from a punza. And go in the toolbox holder. All I have to do is make a little notch here. To accommodate the hose I don't have any or I may shift it forward and just come out with a I think I have elbows for that and make a loop just like a refrigerator so when you pull it out it accordions I show you you only have one hand. One's got a camera in it. Gotta clean this out. But what a perfect spot. This toolbox isn't there. Bear with me now. I'm trying to be productive today. Just got done welding it, but it's cool already because it's oh and num 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 num. So this will be cool. The preheater will go right there fuel line will go through I got to make a little spot back there and then I'm going to make an attachment here for a strap one of them like a hose strap so basically it'll go in there I think some hinges need a little bit of earl but yeah so at the end of the day before you go home for the next day fill her up it's going to take about three and a half gallons from what I've calculated. It's eight inches or seven and a half inches square by 15 inches long. I did a rough calculation. It's roughly like 3.4 gallons. So I'm getting ready to figure this thing out. I was going to try to put a sight glass here, but it just, by the time I get a sight glass in there with the fittings, I'm only going to have about two inches of clear tube. Unless I find some other, I gotta look online, but I gotta get that thing cleaned up. So that's what I'm doing today. Having a little fun. I don't get to do this often, and that's what drives me is this kind of project. I like to get, uh, I like to do fun, fun, cool stuff once in a while. That's going to be awesome. Like I was saying earlier, kerosene, number one fuel. 
that preheater you'll never have to do well I shouldn't say never don't ever say never but you shouldn't have to do maintenance in a long time on it if you run clean fuel like that it's the other ones where we run them out of the other tank blah 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 so yeah in the long run he'll be I think we'll be better off in this particular application so it's not a high use machine all right, I'll bring you back when I got some more stuff done. I'm gonna sandblast that thing and then figure out how I'm gonna strap it down and all that good stuff, so I'll be back. So that's gonna be it, man. Hey, I found something here. I'll show you that quick. Like I told you, ah, that's gonna come like this and then there's gonna be a loop. So when you pull it out, you got just like your refrigerator at home. I put these little, uh, basically I cut a square tube, welded them in there, and I'm going to use these. These aren't quite long enough, but I'm going to get a couple. They're only a few shekels from the Ponsa man. And that's what's going to hold that puppy in there. He'll still have room to grab a hold of it pull it in and out so I'm gonna paint it up it's time to paint her up time to paint her up okay guys I got it uh, what do you think of my my hat from mr. Anderson's construction I like watching him he's cool especially when it fell off that cat no that wasn't funny hey I'm back I got this thing oh I got it painted Got my little hoops on it. Got the tank there. We'll put the tank in and show you what it looks like when she's all together. Oh, look at that. That's going to be cool, eh? Yeah, I just wanted to show you that she's all done. Bring you back in for another round. And look at I got a helper out here in the shop today. Yeah. <laughs> oh she's just sit get me off this table. She likes to hang out with me sometimes. You see that tank? She'd fit inside there, at least one of her. Alright. So anyways, that's it. That's done. She's looking to get down and see if she can find any of the crumbs around the break room table from the guys. I'll put her down on the floor. There you go. She's tiny, ain't she? That's mama's dog. Yeah, there she goes. She's going to go snooping. So anyways, with any, any chance and you know what, I'll be working on getting that thing ready this week. And, uh putting it in I think that turned out pretty slick I'm gonna put some uh, that radiator I did I got some radiator cork left over here I'm gonna lay that down so it's got something nice to sit on so it don't rub and shake through itself get those black straps and uh, yeah maybe I'll even polish up that aluminum for the customer I think you'll be happy hope you're happy when you see this that's for you out there in Minnesota so yeah it'll be cool all right that's it for this one we'll see you guys on the next one over and out see you bye